Prostate Cancer UK is here at Westminster today with over 30 of our supporters to speak to MPs about our latest report. Our report, which is called Men United vs Prostate Cancer, Five Inequalities, Five Solutions, has identified five areas where we really think the UK needs to pull up its socks and get better so that men can have better treatment and a better experience of care. The report uh, by Prostate Cancer UK makes important and grim reading. I mean, the reality is that there is too much inequality when it comes to accessing information, support and treatment for prostate cancer. It's something which varies across areas and sadly also varies demographically. And so it's important that all of us, members of Parliament and others, spread the word and the message that whatever it takes, we need to ensure that the message gets out loud and clear to all communities that uh, they need to take prostate cancer seriously. I didn't know anything about prostate cancer when I was diagnosed with it. My friends and family didn't know anything about it. So I've set out when I joined the Prostate Cancer UK was to make people aware. And I've been getting that over to the MPs and saying, you know, that we need something, more money into research, a lot more money into awareness and spread the word because it's, it, prevention is far better than cure at any day. Well, I unfortunately had prostate cancer 12 years ago and I had successful radiotherapy treatment for it. But the point I want to make is that I had no symptoms at all and it was just chance that my GP uh, did a blood test. I think we have to recognise that MPs on almost any issue will have their own agenda. The question is getting them onto our agenda. We're asking them specifically to send letters to key people in the National Health Service. They've given us a pledge to do that. Yes, they have. Now we just want to see them do it. We have to encourage the people of this country that this isn't some kind of minor uh, illness. It, is a, it, it can be deadly.